What up YouTube, I'm Mr. Mac. Welcome back to the Mac Shack for episode two of our Paper Mario The Origami King Let's Play. And we have been dumped in a tree here. Um, we are back, yes, for daily episodes too as we uh, wriggle Mario out of that tree. Uh, daily episodes for this series. So we're gonna keep the uh, daily upgodes going as often as we can. We're going to get, uh, oh, we need Olivia to use the thousand fold arms technique, right? So we can't do that just yet because Olivia's missing. So we're going to try and find Olivia. Maybe we can smack some of these trees and I'm guessing that nothing's going to happen with that. Uh, no, that's not it. Okay. Well, it was worth a try. Maybe Olivia's in the same tree that we were in. Uh, no, it doesn't appear to be the case. That one's not going anywhere. Oh, little, little bit of a tr uh, Oh, here we go. Hang on. Watch out. Unless you can float like me, I'd be careful over there, Mario. You see that huge hole in the ground? I don't think you'd like falling into it. Maybe there's a way to fix it. But how? Hmm. I've got to catch this. I got an... Empty confetti bag. Did you see the colorful scraps of paper that showered out of the tree when you fell? That's confetti. Everything here is made of paper, of course, so every little bit of confetti is like a tiny piece of our world. So I think if you gather enough confetti and sprinkle it on the hole, it might just fix the problem. The icon tells you how much confetti that you have. Try hitting flowers, grass, knock confetti loose. Okay, well, let's go... Oh, it's like a little confetti hoover. Let's go. Okay. So, good thing we've knocked down heaps of confetti already. We can just, like, run around and grab it. I have a feeling you've collected enough confetti by now. Maybe try heading over the hole very carefully. Maybe my confetti bag is full? I don't know. I don't think it's getting any fuller anyway. All right. Alright, now, what you want to do here is get kind of close to that totally scary pit. When you're ready, press Ed ZR to throw some confetti, confetti on it. You don't have to do sound effects, but I think they're kind of fun. Yeah. Whoosh. Wow. Waha. Oh, sick. We're getting paid. Sounds like it worked. Well, if it worked this one time, it should work every time. Call me optimistic. Okay, optimistic. I thought you were Olivia. Oh, <laughs> whoops. Maybe you can help me get my head unstuck somehow. Sure thing. Push and hold. There we go. And Olivia is back. That's much better. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Now, where are we? There's no one around to ask for directions. This could be a problem. It seems like all we can do is explore this tiny area a little bit. Yeah, no worries. We know exactly what we're going to do. But first, we want to get some confetti and fill up our confetti bag. I don't know if there's an indication that it's full or not, but it's looking pretty, pretty green there. I'd say that's pretty close to full. So it's always good to be prepared. Uh, and we're going to go over here now and use our thousand fold arms. Here we go. Uh-oh. Oh, that's cool. Okay, we're gonna knock it over just like that and we are free. I really am enjoying these little abilities that Mario has all around the place. And we've picked up a mushroom in three dimensions. That's interesting. You should be able to see all the items you've collected by opening the menu. Push Y and select an item to use it right away. That's nice. And convenient, apparently. All right, we're going to roll on through here. Wow, wait, I could soak this view up all day long. I mean, just look at the top of the mountain. It's so... Wait, what's that? Yeah, the castle's gone. That's the outer crust of Peach's castle, isn't it? I saw my brother's streamers wrapping around it, lifting it into the air. And then it was gone. Uh, yeah, it's over there. Wait, there it is. 
See, way up on top of that distant mountain, and still wrapped up tightly with all of those streamers. My brother could be in there with Princess Peach. Ah, oh, he's probably just plodding away. I'm gonna stop you, brother. As your sister, it's my duty. Oh, speaking of brothers, uh, I saw a green hat falling into the hole where the castle used to be. I'm so sorry, the green hat was related to your hat, wasn't it? Yeah, that was Luigi. Oh, I just knew I was right about that hat. This is a big problem. Might be good to hurry back to where it fell and see what's going on. Oh, we should look for your brother while we're at it. I hope he's okay too. Luigi does have a history of playing some impressive roles in Paper Mario games, so we could be uh, really onto something exciting uh, here if uh, some of the previous games in the series are anything to go by. Um, Long-time fans of the Paper Mario series would remember the Green Thunder, Mr. L, uh, one of my all-time favorite characters. Someone's here. Is it? Who is it? Up here. Someone with a mustache. Oh, they're talking about me. It's a flat paper person. It is. Is the mustache also paper? Interesting. No. Oh, that's not enough to fill in that hole. Now we've got enough. There we go. I want to just sneak back here. I feel like those spikes are definitely going to hurt me. So I don't want to go near them if I can help it. But I do want this item block. A, th a thousand coins. How can he just do that? Just whacking things. Not very green of him. Nice hammer. They love it. They love me. I'm famous. Ooh. Just, I'm just going to keep bashing it see what happens. Nothing, clearly. But I've filled up my confetti pouch again, which is good. Stranger alert. Ooh. Is it one of the mean paper guys? It might be. Cool hat, though. Yeah, it is a cool hat. This is great. It's this way. Nothing. Oh, there's a chest up there. Right, let's go get that. Uh, ooh, we don't really want to be part of that spiky pit. Uh, <clears throat> interesting. Interesting. How do we get up there? I guess we just go this way in a second. I really want that chest though. Um, I guess I'll just have to be patient and maybe come back to that. Uh, yep, we can go this way. We can get up on here, up on here. Can I climb these? Okay, no, it just gives me money. Is he gonna pull it? Yes. Ooh, okay. Interesting. Has he found the spring? Show him the thing. Oh, this will be good. Well, we'll just keep... Uh, I think you'll figure it out. Well, I probably won't figure it out. I'm going to give you a, a hot tip. Oh, let's just pull this. Uh-oh. Maybe not, uh-oh. That seems to be positive. We've brought a flower back to life. I don't actually know what that means. But, oh, okay. Well, we almost... I can't stop looking at the moustache. Who does he think he's fooling? This is a cool little item, this uh, confetti dealio. Okay, I'll have that. Faded fire flower. Would watering it restore its potency? Maybe. I don't want to go that way. What's this one do? Nothing. Okay. Oh, it's like memory. Okay. Oops. There we go. Heart. Hmm. 100 coins. Wait, was that 100 coins there? It was 10. Oh, no. Oops. That's 100. Oh, I can get that, though. Here we go. Boom. 100. Thank you. They're impressed. That one matches with that one. I don't know what that is. Oh, it fills up my pouch. Technically correct. Uh, let's go over here. Ah, well, that heart goes here and here. Lovely. So, I don't necessarily need that health, but anyway... I'll get that. A shriveled mushroom. Water it to return it to... So how do I water this stuff? I don't 
don't know. There's our last 10 coins, and we are done. Not bad. Ding, ding, ding. Bingo. Uh, that looks kind of impressive. How do I... Okay. Uh, oh, yes. I can't get up there, though. No. But I can go this way. Yes. Let's go get that chest. Uh, probably didn't use that appropriately, but... I found a collectible treasure, so that's pretty important. Oh, it's cute. You should try to collect more of these, Mario. Maybe even all of them. Yeah. I probably will. Uh, great. So... Yeah. That's interesting. Check out the Musée Champignon in Toad Town to see all of your collectible treasures. I'm assuming the rest. What the heck? Why did I just launch a CD into a, a radio into the lake? Um. Well, let's just pull that one more time and see what. Uh, Birdo. Okay. Surely that's gonna not be good for Birdo. It is going to be good for Birdo. Um, okay. Well, I'm glad that we got that out of the way, at least. <laughs> sure seems like a lot of weird stuff is happening, yeah. Olivia, we are well and truly on the same, same wavelength here, um, I've got to say. Uh, pretty much everything I'm thinking Olivia is saying. So, I'm glad I'm not alone. I'll, uh, I'll say... Oh wait, there's coins in there. Because we need to get all the coins we can. We've only got 1,827. Um, every additional coin is going to be valuable. Now, do you reckon this big crystal ball is going to be a bad time for us or a good time for us? I'm willing to bet that this is going to be the super sneaky secret trick one that hurts us, but let's give it a crack. <laughs> oh snap. It literally did. Uh, we'll get this item box over here by tossing some confetti out. Can we... Okay. Seven! Rough gig. Clearly we can't walk on the confetti until we've actually fixed it properly. Um, at least we get paid for it. <sighs> we really got paid. A uh, thousand is very impressive. That's another bit of confetti. Oh, there probably won't be as much confetti in that tree then. Alright. Let's go deeper into the woods. I mean, this is the kind of thing you just stand on, isn't it? The Whispering Woods. Yeah, what's the worst that can happen? Okay, apparently nothing happens when you do that. Well, oh wait, there's a pathway here. Okay, well, let's just come this way then. Something exciting is going to happen there at some... Stage... Alright, that did nothing. Is this gonna just do the same thing? Okay, what if I go this way? Does it feel like we're not really getting anywhere? It feels exactly like that. Sometimes when the folding gets tough, I like to take a break to clear my head. Let's go sit up on that big stump. Yeah. Just sit down somewhere nice and flat with perfect lighting like on that tree stump. Let's do exactly that. Yeah, probably don't fall asleep though. Hey, who's there? Okay, it's not me. Whoa, you can't sit on old Grand Sappy's head, mister. That's right, he's the elder of this forest. Show some respect, he's got twigs older than you. So what if he's been logged by those nasty little toads? He's still the man, honey. It's the trees that have been talking the whole time. Yes, yes. 
Thank you, Dollins. Bless your bark. You, young man, go back and tell your flat paper friends what a state I'm in. I've hardly the hardwoods to speak, let alone you learn you some matters. <laughs> That's right, tell him, Grand Sappy. No toads allowed. Oh, Grand Sappy hasn't been the same since they cut him down. That's why he's mad at y'all. Flat paper folks cutting down good trees in their prime? Shame on you. Oh, and by the way, you need Grand Sappy's permission if you ever plan on leaving, hun. So now that you're here, better get comfy, because you're going to be here forever. Well, that's unfortunate. I think that means a really long time, and I can't deal with that. Uh, Mr. Grand Sappy, we're not with those flat paper people who did this to you. And actually, I'm not even flat paper, I'm origami. Oh, origami, you say? My eyes aren't what they used to be. Well, if what you said is true, then perhaps you may be of some assistance to me. If you can find a way to restore my energy, I may just let you two leave this place. That's so wonderfully generous of you, truly. I only wish we knew how to restore your energy. Anyway, we're in a hurry ourselves, so we'll do our best to help. I guess if you're going to help Grand Sappy, we'll let you wander around a little bit. And magically, the fog disappears. There you go, child. Now you can be on your merry way along the mountain. Just go, don't go wandering off too far. You've got to find us something called the Soul Seed. They say that's the only thing that can help old Grand Sappy get his energy back. Good luck. Okay. I guess we'll stroll this way then. Oh, the trees are still talking. This is lovely. What does he even want? Is he headed for the spring? Yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, restore some of this stuff. He seems healthy enough. Look at him jump. Is he trying to help Grand Sappy? Yeah, I am, amazingly enough. I was just about to whack that bush. Wave battle, here we go. All right, let's put into practice what we learned in the last episode. Well, it's been a while since that first battle, hasn't it? I think I remember how everything works. Do you? Let's give it a shot. All right. So, first thing we've got to do is line them up. So, this seems familiar. Yep, I remember exactly how to fo line up these folded soldiers. Remember how to move rings? Yeah, just let me figure it out. I got this. And then we line them up like that. Great line up, attack power up. Alright, so now we go boots because we want to jump and go long range. Alright. We got this. We're all over this. Thanks, Liv, for the help. Oh, there is action commands in this game too. Fantastic. Press A as soon as it appears. I'm all over this, don't worry. I gotta push a little bit earlier. I wonder if they have fancy as well. So I can do some extra like tricks. If you can land multiple action commands, you'll take your enemies out in no time. Yep, I definitely will. This time though, it's hammer time. So we're gonna learn um, action commands for the hammer, hopefully too. Yep, I got you fam. I spread out a bit differently this time. Yep, I'm all over this. I know exactly what to do. We go like this. Great lineup in there. I'm such a pro, I know. And now we want to go hammer. Start battle. All right. You can use action commands with the hammer too. You'll see a burst behind you as you wind up. Press A when the burst flashes brightest. Okay, here we go. Let's figure out when that burst is. Yes, straight up when it feels. That was a thing of beauty. You smashed all four Goombas with a single swing. You know me, Olivia. Super important action command when enemies be attacking you. Press A just before you get hit. All right. Well, I haven't been hit yet, so I think we're doing okay. Gimme, give gimme give all those coins. 507. We are so rich. This is great. Taking out those folded soldiers released a ton of confetti. We can use as much as we can find with all of the terrible holes around here, I'd say. What a great deal. And when they explode, it's like a party. It is. This is great. I love the confetti. How are there already folded soldiers this deep into the forest? Do you think they're just going around causing trouble everywhere? I have such a bad feeling about this. Me too, Olivia. Me too. Like, look at this gigantic hole here. I'm glad we've got a ton of confetti to cover the hole in. I'm just going to throw some extra because, you know, I've got so much of it. 
Oh, I feel bad about crushing the flowers though. Oh, I bet you there will be um, like sneak attacks as well. Ooh, that, first of all, um, that's really rude. Yeah. There's no way you can line them up in a single move. We'll be crumpled before our adventure's even begun. That's just mean. Oh, we get two ring moves. Looks like you get two chances to move the ring in one turn. Yeah, good. I, I'm all over this, Olivia. You leave the rings up to me. I've got this under control. So we're gonna go like this, and then we're gonna go like this. Great lineup, attack power up. Boots, let's go. Mario's turn. Okay, I don't know if there's a fancy or not, but that was, it. yeah, pretty cruisy. Pretty cruisy, really. Boom. Thank you. Okay. Uh, oh, talk. What? Hi. Ah, I can't believe I had one of those folded things hiding on me. Is that what it feels like when you walk into a spy web? <laughs> no, I feel terrible. Take these and we'll call it even. Um. Okay. Have you got one too? No. So if you defeat one of those folded creatures that turns into confetti, that information could really save a lot of trees, you know. Yeah. Ah, oh, this is the spring here. Yes. Okay. There is like battle start action commands as well. Fantastic. Ooh, here we go. Yeah, I can do this. All right. So we go like this. And then we go like that. All right. Now we go... Whoa, there are a lot more folded soldiers this time. We'll never hit all of these enemies with a single attack. Is this the end? Is this really our final battle? <laughs> it's been an honor to fight alongside you, Mario. Come on, Liv. We've got two actions here, love. That's okay. We're going to be fine. We get two attacks in this one turn. Try selecting your first attack now. Boots. Let's go. Mario's turn. Yeah, buddy. We've still got an action left. Yes. Oh, yeah. All right. Second attack time. Ooh, we don't want boots though. We want hammer this time. Here we go. Mario's turn. There we go. Smashing those Goombas. You're almost unstoppable with two actions. Yep. You know it, Olivia. I'm all over this. Gimme those coins. 272. Not bad, not bad. We're over 4,000 now. Have you got anything to say for yourself, young man? Yeah, why are those photo guys so bent out of shape? I don't get it either. Let's just repair this little patch in the ground. Get ourselves two coins. Now, what do you reckon? Let's check the spring. Hey, this is that spring that we saw before. I feel calmer somehow, just standing near it. Normally, I wouldn't suggest this. Yeah, let's try throwing the faded fire flower in there. And then we'll get an actual fire flower. Oh, look at that! It's amazing. Use it to throw fireballs at enemies. Nice. Alright. Well, we might as well throw the shriveled up mushroom in there as well. And get a proper mushroom from it. Because, you know, why not? Um, seems legit. Okay. Now we'll just fix up this little hole here. There's probably a way that I can, like, target more than one area at once. But... There's another treasure chest around here. So we'll get... I bet you it's got that little sapling in it. No, it's got a mushroom collectible treasure. Alright. Well, that's not bad. You wouldn't believe the restorative power this string has. Wrinkles gone. Dry spots wet. It's amazing. Hmm. Yes, but that's not actually going to help me when I don't have the object that I need. I have nothing else to put in the spring, Olivia. So that's not going to help me. Is there a direction that I have not travelled in yet? Um, it's also highly likely. Not that way. No. Apparently there's not. Well, we'll save that and we'll come back. We may come back here shortly. Unless it's in the spring. What do you have to say for yourself? Nothing? 
Don't come back without that seed. Yeah, but I don't know where the seed is. No. Someone will know. Dangling from my cousin's neck. Hmm, okay. I don't have anything for you, I'm sorry, Grand Sappy. Well, this is troubling. I don't think it'll be back this way. Yeah, it's definitely not back this way. There will be something that I've missed in my travels down this way. And you guys are probably like screaming at me. Well, not screaming at me, but you're probably suggesting nicely in the comments where I could have found the, uh, the thing that I'm looking for. Um, whether I have to just like, okay, no. Also, no, that's just confetti. Um, hey, no, that's just a confetti bag. Um, there's nothing there. I'm feeling a little bit perturbed by this. Because there should be somewhere that I can go, or something that I can do, surely. Uh, but in fact, there is not. Maybe I have to hit those other trees? Maybe it is back behind me. Uh, they just give me a huge amount of confetti. Of course they wouldn't have this, the, um, the thing that I'm looking for. I forget what it's even called now. Okay. Um, where else can I potentially go? Up here? Uh, no, I can't get that. Oh, why don't I just, like, hit you with a hammer? Yeah. Here we go. Alright. It's time. Give me those arms. Oh. Oh, it is there. I was like, that was relatively unimpressive, but we've we've got the shriveled seed now, and it's time to throw it into the restorative spring, and we'll get the soul seed back again. Well, that was a nice little, you know, detour, travel, travel around the uh, whispering woods there. That's hammer. Uh, oh no no no! I don't want Olivia. No 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 no! Oh, I was just trying to walk a bit faster. Oh, that does confetti. Both L and R do confetti. There's no faster way to move, but that's okay. We just got the soul seed, Olivia. It's amazing. Yes, I'm gonna put the soul seed in the spring, and then we're gonna get its soul back and restore Grand Sappy to its former glory. Give it to old Grand Sappy. Uh, unless he dies beforehand. I think it might have been old Grand Sappy crying out. He seemed pretty feeble, but that was no feeble. Uh, oh no, oh no. Do you think he's okay? Well, there's only one way to figure it out, Olivia. We're gonna have to go. No time to stop and whack the flower. I know I'm not stopping to whack the flowers. I am hurrying. What happened to whispering? <laughs> Hurry, please. Yeah, I know the trees are panicking. Look at their eyes going everywhere. Uh, well, that's rude. Oh dear. I, I can't look. Poor thing, he's a shell of himself, hollowed out like some woodshop project gone wrong. Can't believe those horrible things ganged up on old Grand Sappy and did this to him. They, they deserve to be chipped. Can I just confetti him? This doesn't look good. He was already creaky. Now he's downright hollowed out. Oh. I've got an idea. Look closely. Doesn't it look like one of those holes? Maybe that means you can fix him with confetti by pressing ZR. Ah, oh, it's gonna happen. But his soul's not going to come back, I bet. No, he's back. He's okay. We fixed up the rain. Oh, what happened? Felt like some rapscallion was willing me down again. Did I just dream it? 
I suppose that's just the memory going downhill. Ah, oh, nuts. Grand Sappy's back, y'all. Let's see, moustache, check. Creepy eyebrows, check. It's Grand Sappy again, all right. Oh, thank you. He's still a shell of himself, but it's better than being a shell of a shell. We've got our precious elder back. Well, he's not hollow anymore, but it does seem like he could be more energetic somehow. And we've got the soul seed. Yeah, chew on that, Grand Sappy. Is he just gonna, like, explode into a tree? Doing something, watch out now. Soul Seed! Oh my goodness! Wow. I was not expecting that either, Olivia. Looking good, Grand Sappy. I'm so happy for you. Yeah, now that's what I'm talking about. That little seed was all it took. Tighten up my timbers and put the funk back in my trunk. I'm young again. I see no need to keep you all waiting any longer unless you want to run through that song and dance again. Shrubs open up for my main moustache and his little lady here. You got it. Oh, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Bye for now, Grand Sappy. I'm glad we could be of service. That is absolutely amazing. What a way to finish this episode. Yes, at the half an hour mark, we are going to call it there. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well. We have Paper Mario the Origami King coming your way every single day uh, until we get to completion of the playthrough. So thanks again and I will speak to you soon.